a boy wants me to uh, record this for him. So yeah, um, yeah. Honestly, uh, a lot of people in the chat should be on this call because it's very, you know, just it's uplifting just to be around that positive vibe, and you know, it's key to our mindset. Exactly, you know, like we're all trying to, you know, we're all trying to learn the same thing, and so it's like, you know, we're trading ideas, trading, uh, you know, different aspects. Yeah, and so, you have to, I mean, that's the thing about people nowadays. They're so closed-minded. They're not able to um, get other people's perspectives on on things like, okay, how does this person think? All right, no, they're they're with their ideas. If it's no way or the highway, basically, like, and that's what's wrong. Yeah. Getting everybody's perspective on you know on anything you want to know is is key. Key. Yup. Straight up. Straight the fuck up. Oh, Plus, like, there's so much to learn, you know, like, like, there's like, there's so much to this that it's important to just have different opinions, you know, like, you don't, you don't have to, like, believe everyone, but at least consider it or like, you know, yeah, yeah, you got to do your own, do your own analysis. And then, you know, if they seem to be right, then roll with it. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, we're seeing this right here. Um, it is on the weekly too. Yeah. So you're even seeing, uh, honestly. So Bitcoin get hit like six k. Yep. 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 Around the six, and it's gonna retrace back. Yep. Yeah. I'm gonna put in another cell. Savage. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, I would too, dog. But I kind of blew my account, so I'm kind of <laughs> I can't do hey, no moves right now. I remember, dude. Did I did I tell you I lost? I I well, I was trading Bitcoin for the first time, bro. It was right before Christmas. I flipped two hundred dollar account into three grand, bro. But then I lost it all, bro. Oh. <laughs> I got greedy, bro. I was so <laughs> pissed. Remember McConnell? I was depressed. Yeah, yeah, you were. Yeah, I, I called McConnell. I was depressed, bro. I was like in my room, like dead, bro. Like I was just, like, I'm done. I'm about to quit. I was like, I'm done with this shit. Like, fuck this. I'm done. I was so pissed, bro. I feel you, man. I'm there. I'm fucking there. But yeah, but I was know. pissed. But hey, but it, it helped me learn, bro. I grew from it. Now I'm just chilling. You know, don't get attached yeah. to the money. Just chill, dog. And I don't Next exactly time, lose it. I yeah. actually like to look at it as, you know, failure yeah. where it's just uh, getting results, you know? Exactly. Yeah. Like like a lot of people say, you know, they, they love failure because, you know, without failure that you wouldn't know what not to do, you know, the next time you wouldn't know how to, you know, everything happens for a reason and its purpose. We just have to figure out what not to do the next time and learn from our mistakes we've did in the past and not bring it into the present. Exactly. Word. Yep. yep. Truth, brother. Yep. But I mean, uh, hey, uh, you guys want to see? Let's try to do this real quick. You want to see your boy scalping on the one minute? Yeah. Yeah. I'm scalping off the 15 minute right now. Yeah, it looks like it's going to keep going down right now. Yeah, this isn't gonna. Uh, this isn't gonna go based off like live action. It's gonna go based off of uh, it updates every minute. So as you see, um, but yeah, it says thirty-two seconds. So it's gonna update in twenty-eight seconds, twenty-seven. Wait, what is the next candlestick? Uh, yeah. Isn't live. Uh, Trading view isn't a live. Uh, it's based upon, you know, they update it from, you know, brokers or whatever. Oh, okay. All right. You're on trade. Oh, shit. Sure. Yeah, so in oh, terms of bro, I see it. Seconds, yeah. Candle 6, watch. You see it? Oh, right shit, bro. You see that, right? Okay, so it's about yeah. See, it's starting to kick in. Yeah, this looks like about to go down, man. Yeah, the bands are squeezing tight. Something's about to happen. Yeah, yep. it's about to drop, man. Let's think about the drop. And the London session's in an hour. It's going to be crazy in an hour. Oh, yeah, when the next uh, four-hour can candlestick starts? Yeah, like London session, 11 o'clock, is about to just be crazy. 
about to like fluctuate so fast. Dang! Look at how many tap. Look at how many taps are at eight seven four nine. Oh shit! That's right. Jesus. Damn it. Oh my gosh! Do you see that? Yeah. So there's a shoe back up. Starting to right now, but let's see. Yeah. You're oh, I see it. Yeah, it's touching the. It's going up again. Oh shit. Oh. Oh shit. The harmonics. Grew up that lot long though. Huh? You see this a. Yeah, it's going hey, up. Did, did, it just, did it just touch that trend line? Did, did anybody see that? <laughs> yeah, I'm watching up. it right now. It touched yeah. the trend line. It's, so it's going like up. Huh? on point. Uh, yeah, it, it might pass this trend line. Um, oh, shit. But, yeah, it just did. Because it's at the tight squeeze. You see the tight squeeze right there? Hold on. Yeah. Yeah, you got the tight squeeze right here, and boom. Instantly on the minute chart, as soon as that tight squeeze happened. But... Um, as it already passed the Bollinger Band. It's not you can't you can't see it right now because it's not updated. But it already passed the Bollinger Band, and for sure, mm. as soon as how fast it went up, it's gonna go right back down. That's if because, and don't get me wrong. There's a lot of times that we see right here the it'll go out of the Bollinger Band and keep on going up. See the next yeah, it's going up. So let's see if it you know, I strongly believe it might not because. Um, mm, looks like it is barely. Oh yeah, yeah. I don't. Think it, I don't think it'll pass this trend line. It might. It might. But look at. Oh yeah, this trend line's even drawn wrong. Wow. Right there. Yeah, scalping on the one minute is crucial. Oh yeah. See, that's the trend. Yeah, I'm gonna change my time frame to five minute. In a minute. Yeah, and there's no. Uh, I can't confirm. Uh, um, oh shit! It's dropping, bro. Oh yeah. Oh that's where you, shit! That's where you put when it hits that whoa. line. That's where you put yourself. Whoa! Yeah. Whoa! Yeah. Boom! Boom! Uh. boom. Catching pips. Catching. <laughs> what the? Imagine if you had standard lot size. Catching pips. Boom. Oh, bro. oh yeah. Don't be scared now. It's gonna. Oh, this is crazy. It's, Wait. It's gonna retrace. You know. Don't. don't so it makes the most moves around like the last five minutes before it closes. Well, if you were trading on a actual live broker, like straight live, you'll see the price actions move way more faster than this. See, we're getting see it, see it. So, I mean, boom, 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 boom. Whoa, bro, I'm, bro. You know what I'm saying, dude. I mean, bro, I'm getting close to the profits now. Oh shit! Look at what I <laughs> my chart saved under. Oh this. no, bro. Bits and oh shit. <laughs> Bro, it's just crazy, bro. Yeah. If Dude. you want to draw something right here, if you want to see if you need to get out of the trade, I'm not sure if it's going to – it might tap this 8751, you know, because a lot of people are tapping it. But I don't think this is even plausible for this. But, I mean, you could do it. But let's see if it taps it or not. And here's the little thing I'm talking about right here. This little pendulum, you got the you got the line right yeah. here. It's it's actually drawing the triangle. So whichever way it ends up on, it's gonna pass the, this trend right here. If it ends up over here, once it passes this line, white line, if it ends up at the bottom, boom, it's gonna shoot that way. If it ends up at the top, it's possible to break trend. Wait, it passes what line again? Can you say it again? This one right here, you see the this white line that draws it. You see the triangle? Yeah. But honestly, it looks like it's you see. So you see this. You see these things right here. Okay. So here's the candlestick, 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 and it's actually you can kind of see it if you vision like you have a vision in your mind of a line right here, right? So yeah, the line off the bottom of this one. Dude, it's dropping, yeah. dude. Go like this, you know. So it's closing in right here. This line actually, it might go up a little bit, but. Going down. So that would be a perfect entry. Say you're like, oh, I'm a trade right now. It's going down. Say like if you're in the chat right now, 
oh, I'm going to put in a trade right now. It's going down. You know, you put yeah. in your trade, right? You put in your trade and say if current price is at uh, 87.80 and it just goes up to what? If it, if it goes up to right over here, uh, 88.14, you could blow your account. You like straight up. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> that quick. So you're on the floor. This is a one minute. I never go on the one minute. Um, I would like to start going on it though, but so you so five, five, five minutes more. So you verify your trend on the uh, on the four hour. Okay, you'll be like, all right, it's gonna go down. It's going down. So what the highest point the buyers got in the market? You just line. He said, so verify the trend on the four hour. Yeah, but this uh, you see the trends over here. They kind of start back. You know, they're not really. So you're going off of something. See, there's no, this right here is a perfect example. See this trend, if it was down here, I could easily draw this trend right here because the downtrend. So right here, if I drew all these matching these bottom candlesticks right here, all the way up to that other uh, downtrend line, the bottom one's the uptrend line, the down one, the top one's the downtrend line. So yeah. if you can, it's not doing it right now, but. If this yellow line was all the way straight and it draws that triangle, that's how you know, that's when you enter, you know, that's how I enter my trades, you know. There's other ways, you know. Uh, it not verifying an uptrend, that means there's continuous downtrend. You know what I'm saying? It's just the other way around. If, it, if you can't find a, a, an uptrend and you're like, oh, shoot, when I enter, when I enter, just throw in, a, throw in the trade because obviously, but that's why you go back to the one minute. Oh, okay. Yeah, because you go back to the one minute, and then you'll know when you can actually. Look at this. And what did I just wow. say? <laughs> oh, wow. You see what I'm saying? It's What's you, have to, you know what I'm saying? It's, I don't. You know, I get all tongue twisted and everything because I'm thinking about it, and it's. it's uh, I might. I might need to get out of this trade. Uh. It's going up, so I'm gonna sell. Oh. Now, see, this would be a perfect time to enter your trade. It's not at the line. See, boom, what did I say? It's, it didn't touch, it didn't pass that triangle line right here. It didn't pass. So it's going back down? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. So let's see if it goes back. If, it, if this ends, if this candlestick ends at that bottom, it's going to pass it. It's going gonna, it's gonna to continue to go down. It's going to go up. You're gonna have to re. You're gonna have to redraw your trend line. You know what I'm saying? You just keep on redoing it. You know that's how you. The scalping the market is very easy, but it's very addicting. It, it can be. You can be lost for hours. You know. Trust me, I know. <laughs> From experience. How do you? How do you? How do you do that? That line you did, for the minute. So you did a trend line. I'm confused, bro. Yeah, yeah. Oh, like, what, wait, so, where do you put it? This one right here. Yeah. Yeah. So, all right. You see how um, I'm able to? Okay. So right here, we'll do it. Why do you put that on that candlestick right there? Like the because like it verifies, five back behind it. It's verifying an uptrend. So, say right here. Um, let's go back a little bit more. So right here is perfect. Um, you see the uptrend starting. Yeah. You you could have done it to right here. So you had this going. All right, let's just draw this up. All right, focus on this real quick. All right, so we're just doing this, right? So here is the pendulum. Here's the triangle line. You see that line that draws the triangle that completes this triangle, like a pyramid, so to speak? Right. So you're drawing this trend line. And it's just, oh, so it draws up, right? It passes this white line. Oh, and it finishes, the candlestick finishes above what I, what I was saying, and what happened? Boom, out of that pendulum. Oh. So now you retrace, you got to redo, re strategize, you got to redraw your trend lines. You have to, and this is what you're following. And now there's no, well, I mean, there's a verified downtrend, but it starts up from right here. So, I mean, you could do this right here. Mm -hmm. But, I mean, even still, uh, that's too close. It's not an actual triangle, so it's not going to give you like a hundred percent verification. You know what I'm saying? 
Mm-hmm. Look, it still hasn't. Hey, it looks like it's going to go down again, though, bro. You see yep. the candlesticks forming? Yeah, so it pass, it's passing on yeah. the bottom right here, right? And mm-hmm. since it passed that line, it's going to pass this line. It's going to break trend. It's going to break that uh, uptrend because it finished in the pendulum. It finished uh, at the bottom of the candlestick. So you see it breaking right now. Boom. What do you mean break oh, the uptrend? What did I say? What do you mean break the uptrend? Like, yeah. <laughs> what do you mean break the trend? Like go down? Yes. Yeah, so Holy the, shit. the bottom the bottom what? line is your uptrend. Did you just call that, bro? Yeah, I just called it talking to y'all. <laughs> what the fuck? Bro, yeah. I'm still I'm still in a cell right now, bro. Okay, so Damn, what? I'm still can, you my, can you see my mouse right here? Can you see it moving? To Holy the shit. Yeah, so I'm watching it. I'm watching it. These lines right here, if if you can draw a line and it, it matches, okay, these two match. Okay, all right. If these two match. Wait, what two match? What two match? So how, I, how I even got this was all these taps right here. What? Uh, at mm-hmm. 8751, you have one, two, three, four, five, six. Three, multiple taps, even over here. So oh, from the – oh, on the support? Yeah. 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 At, that, at that time, I couldn't draw the trend line from here. I couldn't draw right. this candlestick because you want to get the candlestick from the – up. you know, the bottom the bottom trend line. You mm-hmm. want that to be the lowest point at the market to verify the uptrend. So you go to the lowest point and you'll find – and then you start the top the top line from the highest point of the market and you go down. But they have to match, you know. You have to have at least two to three – candlesticks matching and so oh wait wait the lower the lower to match the kind of oh, you're breaking the, the hut like if we turn it sideways it looks like a hut yeah exactly you and know what i'm saying the look the trend line forms yeah. like a hut you turn it to the, like the right a little bit or the left yeah um it's supposed to oh shit yeah, it's to like this it's called a pen yeah. yeah you go like that but now yeah. we're, we're entering oh the- shit now i can use this friend of mine now I can use this trend line right here. And it looks oh, like for, damn, bro. I don't think I, we might be following this trend right here, but I don't think so. And you're not gonna always have. Nah, it looks like it's about to go down. Yeah, you're not gonna always have the square right here passing, but sometimes it's okay. usually always there. So I think what trend it's following is this one right here. But the down one. No, that's too close. Yeah, you just kind of redo your, you know, redo your thing. Yeah, this is the one that's falling right there. Called that on call as I was recording. Savage. The downtrend? Yeah. Yeah, the top lines are downtrend and the bottom lines are uptrend. Ooh, well, what like- do you mean top lines are uptrend? What top lines? Well, the, this top yellow line right here? That's, oh. your, that's your bottom trend. It's it's indicating uh, it's going. It's it's in a downwards uh, spiral, so to speak. Your your, oh. your bottom oh. your bottom line is your uptrend. It's Down. indicating. Uh, oh. Yep. So it looks like we're following this one right here. Oh no. Yeah, right here is perfect. So yeah, you're gonna see this continue to go down because honestly, that's what's gonna happen. <laughs> Ooh, it might like it might look like this is forming. We're gonna break trend watch. Oh baby, it's going down. I'm gonna sell too. Broke trend. Let's go. Broke trend. Oh no, no. Yep, it did. So, like, as you're seeing it hit the bottom line, you know, as you see it go, oh. if you're scalping, if you're scalping and you see it hit that bottom line, you know, especially when it goes out of these right here, you're going to, obviously, you know, if you have your soul in and you're looking to get out and, and this happens right here and you got this line, okay, when am I going to get out? When am I going to get out? Well, you only got an, another minute to that next candle stick once it stops moving because you're on a live, especially on a broker's account. Once it starts moving or it starts forming a, a, a wick on the bottom, get out, get out, because then it's going to, as fast as it went down, as fast as it's going to, you know, go up. Go back up. Yeah. So this one, it was a full stick, candle, it's a full stick to me. I mean, 
doesn't go down if there's a full one down. Oh, yeah. If there's a full candlestick down, it should go down again for the next minute. Yep. Oh, shit. I called it too. Damn. <laughs> Yeah, and then look at it. It's you're, over. You're, that's, uh, you're, you're going off of that, right? You're a technical. Yeah. Whatever. <laughs> you're going off your indicators. You're going, look at it. You're going, you're going off the indicators off the bottom, right? You have uh, this orange line passing, you know, the red and green line, buyers and sellers, whatever you want to call it. You got, the, uh, you got this little thin line passing the uh, thick line. <laughs> so every time, let's just go back over here. Wait, thin line passing for where? Thin line passing the yeah, what you, line? You see this orange line right here? Yeah. I'm just trying to be a little what? Uh, simplistic. What? It's the RSI MACD, but what's going on right here is, uh, and the moving average, but you basically have this orange thin line every single time it goes over the big line, the thicker line, the red or green one, it goes down. And what is happening? It's going down. <laughs> And it will go down for probably a little bit. You're going to see some big action right now because not only did the bands, so you have the band squeezing right here. You have the band squeezing right here. You got the candlestick. These are confirmations. You got the band squeeze right here. You got the candlestick uh, out of the uh, bands. That's when you put in your cells when you go out of the bands. But And then you got... On your indicators that this orange line is over the seller's line and it's going down when it's under the the buyer's line it's it, the price goes up see orange line under, oh bro the green goes up once it see th these this is where you put in your cells right here right here and then you could have put it in right over here but the indication right here is you're going off of this this is where you're catching it you know and so you're going to see this in probably a downward spiral for a little bit because once these orange and red line, once they start to touch, that's when you're going to start to see some movement. You're going to start, once they get closer, see right here, once they get closer together, you'll see, you'll see them start thinning out, thinning out, and they get closer, and that's what's happening on here. It's going up, boom. And once This is the thin. Once it thins out, consolidates, and then that's what you're seeing right here. It goes up. Retest, crosses the line, goes over. The orange line goes up now on but above the, the sellers and boop, drops. Damn, bro. Is this still on the 30-second uh, time minute. frame? Yeah, this on a minute. Oh, a minute? Yeah. This happened right now, like after. Yeah. The yeah as I ended, Damn, bro. As I'm I, in profits now, bro. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh shit! I was gone for like thirty seconds, dude. Yeah, but did you see? Did you, did, it, did you understand the triangle? And as soon as it forms that, what you know, the triangle on that thing, and then yeah, yep. Yeah. Oh, bro, dude, and, this is yeah. real, bro. I get this now. I yeah. understand it. What's hey, what's up? What's that? What's that indicator on the bottom? The red and green. What is that? How do you add that? What is that? To the chart. That's the MACD, right? Uh, yeah, you'll type the this right here. You'll type in just Uncle L, and it's uh, it's not that one. Where did it go? This is what made me delete my. Uh, oh, your shit, yeah. Oh, right here. Oh. What's it called? M RSI? Or the, um, yeah, the MACD. Uh, uh, MACD? Yeah. MACD uh, do it or do it. Do it. Do it. Oh. <laughs> oh, bro. I'm in another profit. Holy shit. Damn. Get it. Bro, I'm starting to understand this. I'm going to take profit, too. Yeah, take profit, close, uh, take yeah. profits, close. Take profits, close it, and open them. Open another one as it's going down, so you're not you don't lose money. But make sure. Yeah, I don't want to get greedy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Holy shit. Over leveraging is using yeah. over twenty percent. Oh, I'm not. Account. 
try to use uh, at least only 20% of your account. Uh, I only did uh, only one right now. I'm only I'm starting slow again with O one just for the first time. Just taking like three dollar profits and shit. Nice. Nice. Yeah, I just took another three dollar profit. So I'm just gonna chill right for the next candle. Oh yeah, this is what I was gonna do. Hell yeah. I'm up like four bucks. Um Yeah, bro, remember McCon yeah, McConnell when I made that that three grand, bro. I once did a lot that was like point fifty, dude. It was crazy. <laughs> <laughs> and like one trade, I won like like six hundred, seven hundred dollars. This shit was hey, crazy, bro. Get this. <laughs> and, uh, Abu was in California. He came over to visit, and uh, I was live trading right in front of him, scalping. And like, dude, instantly, like you know, four fifty, five hundred, and dude, it was crazy, right? <laughs> We're all standing there, and he's like, "Yeah, man, that's." You know, just we're all hyped and everything, right? So I go to put in in my next trade, and instead of 0 .50, 0 .50. Oh no! Oh. My account didn't even handle. Uh, didn't, dude, instantly gone right in front of him, but I didn't even show him the screen. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll be pissed. <laughs> no, never even told him. <laughs> yeah, that's about that. What do you got? Damn, bro. Dude, I think I'm starting to understand this, this scalping strategy. Yeah, it's... Yep. Uh, Makanda does that to you. He breaks <laughs> it down. Yeah, I need to I, I know this, My speech could be a little bit better, and I, I know that, but, I mean, I, I'm, I'm trying, you know. Mm -hmm. the, 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 it's Good there, book. you know. It's there. I, the, before those lines are even drawn, I'm like, okay, a line goes right here, a line goes right there. <laughs> But always follow the indicators, get more than, uh, I like to get four or five confirmations. Like, okay, this is downtrending, one indicator. Okay, RSI is dropping, oh, MACD's, you know, sellers in the market. You know, just, you add all those up and, you know, it's it's for sure going to go your way. Like, what just happened right now? Like, you know? Mm -hmm. It's kind of trippy to think about. It tapped there, what? Oh, it's, no. Yeah, it's ta it's going up and then going down again. It's like weird. Wait till eleven though, huh? Eleven's about to be crazy because the London session, so it's about to be like going fast. It looks like it's about to go down more. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Well, I'm in another cell right now. So we're we're looking at this. Uh, we're looking at this. How thick they are. You know, they're not that. Okay, we'll do this right here. Mm -hmm. Let's see. We got this right here. So like right there. <laughs> so it's almost time for another buy, huh? So it's about to, uh, I don't know. Like maybe uh, that with it just being right there. It's like consolidating in the minute. Yeah. So you see how fat that, uh, how fat they're spaced out. Yeah. You got your trend line right here too, huh? Yeah, we got uh oh about the call's about to expire. The call's about to uh do a, <laughs> do a Rick James on me. Oh bro. <laughs> That's your couch. <laughs> <laughs> no, no trend, no. Oh, it's going up. Fuck. Oh, shit. Nope, see oh. the squeeze? See the squeeze on the... Uh, oh, shit. Putting some work right now. <laughs>